Well, it all I suppose started um, back in the day with a, a more looking at a health and safety perspective, not wanting to just rely on engine brakes of some of the old trucks. So we got the new um, Mercs with Talmai retarders, so you're not having to use your brakes coming down off the hill. And then we were sort of thinking, well, why waste all that um, energy into heat or, or nothing when you know there's the potential to be regenerating it um, using the electric model. Uh, it's very simple to drive. It's um, uh, got a, I think it's a seven speed automatic gearbox. So um, you pretty much just have to um, flick it into drive and, and, and go along. It's just, yeah, I suppose getting used to the, um, the feel of the regeneration and the fact that that's actually used via your brake pedal, whereas in the other trucks we've got a um, lever on the side. So it's just, yeah, getting a feel for um, how it all runs, I suppose. And yeah, yeah, the driver's loving it. He uh, really, really enjoys it. And he's taken a lot of pride in, um, in it. And I suppose being the, you know, the first person or the only guy driving an electric truck, I think he finds that pretty cool. So he, he gets out and he, takes a notebook every day of um, where we're carting and what sort of energy ratings we're getting and all that. Over the course of the day, we can, we've sort of ranged anywhere between four to 18% of charge. Um, and this depends on where we're carting and just how we're driving. And we think that's gonna get better over time. So, you know, we're only having a charge at every third day. Whereas with the diesel, we're putting probably about 90 to 100 litres of diesel in a day, yeah. Just a, another quarry that's carting downhill really, um, going, so going up empty and then coming downhill with the full load. We notice a big difference if we say only, you know, don't quite get as much load on it, you don't get that regeneration as, as, as much coming down the hill. Um, but we are certainly going to try and put it on a transporter and take it to a couple of the other sites and just try it at around um, you know maybe something with an uphill cart as well actually we've been really happy with the um, initial performance of it it's slightly slower up and down the hill but it's um, it's carrying more more load so we're getting 30 ton on this where we're getting 20 ton on the others